Here it is, our one and only 1954 San Francisco Seals program. I can't remember opening it, so I guess we'll do it together. As I've said before, this is the bluest one out of all of them. The other ones seem to be either sun faded or they came out like that from the printer. Just a kind of a light color. I should ask my pop about that. Instead of being a dummy. Dummy. Oops, sorry about that. Yeah, so we'll go page by page through a 1954 program. See what the difference between the 54, 55, and 56 is. Since you've seen those other two. Let's go. Out of the wrapper. Ready to look at. You learn something new every day. San Francisco Seals, it's called The Little Corporation. And I just found out that in 1956, no, I'm sorry, at the end of 1955, Boston Red Sox bought the San Francisco Seals. Learn something new every day. That's why in the 1956 Seals program, the first page, all these people are all different. My Auntie Lila doesn't work there anymore. None of these people did. Except for Walter Mayles. Just did a show on Ted Beard. Here they call him Little Teddy Beard. He wasn't the biggest guy. But in 1950, he homered over the right field roof at Forbes Field. Only Babe Ruth had ever done that. He's got a few PCL records. This is the one I was talking about in the Ted Beard show about his 11 putouts as an outfielder. Another thing I found out today, Brick Laws. His name is Clarence Brick Laws. He's the owner of the Oakland Oaks. My dad has two of his autographs and he signed it. One, Brick in parentheses, Laws, and the other one, Mr. C period L period Laws. Pretty cool. Nice shot of Elmer. Yeah, this one's cut up. Hmm. One of the few we have that are cut up. Oh, took out somebody's picture, it looks like. Oh, bummer. Darn. Yeah, my dad cut out the picture of the player on the other side. All I know is Clay Hopper is a manager. I'm not sure which team this is. I should know that by now. I'm going to do a show on Clay Hopper, famous manager. Yeah, Daddy O got to this page too, the Seals scorecard. There's a Leo Rigetti there. I see that. Thomas Heath, the manager. Uh, hey, there's Wally Westlake. Nice. Oh, there's uh, Elmer Singleton. They were just talking about him. There's Dave Hiller. Wally Westlake. First white player to be hit by a pitch thrown by a black player. 1947. We had a 1956 that was cut up like that. I took the cover and the back and used those for my binders and cut out these cool little cartoons and ads and also used those on my binders. Nothing goes to waste. There he is, Walter the Great, Duster Males, pitched in World Series 1920. He's a World Series champ. I did a show on Walter, held by legends, signed by heroes. My dad has a couple of his autographs. My dad met him a couple times around the office, over at the SEALs office. Yeah, see, this is they used this in 1955, but a lot of these players' names I'm not familiar with. 1954, I know more of the 1955, 1956 Seals. It's a great Harley ad. A lot of Harley ads back then. I didn't know that. Here's a good one. His nickname is Inky. I don't think it's because of his tattoos. Although you never know, uh, World War II, a lot of guys got tattoos. My gramps did. That's what my tattoos are in memory of. 
traditional style tattoos like they put on the sides of those World War II bombers. Chicks and animals. Got some Lefty Gomez talk here and some Luke Easter talk. Ed Lopat and some umpire named Larry Knapp. Some Joe DiMaggio talk and some Casey Stengel talk. Ooh, talking about Marilyn Monroe. Yogi Berra talk. And the back. You know how I roll. I've never seen the back of this one. 1955 is also about TV sets. 1956, the back cover was about a candy bar. Oh, that's it. Page by page, look at a cut up 1954. That's funny because it's the nicest looking cover we have. The bluest. I always say that, I know, but it is the bluest cover. And it's really clean. A little notch up there. But yeah, eh, it's the only one we got and it's cut up. Looks great in the binder. Have I said it yet? Souvenir programs here. Well, we got to visit my Auntie Lila in the ticket office. Nice. Thanks for coming along on a trip. 1954, San Francisco Seals, page by page. Peace.